to another video in the MyAccess series. In this one, I'm going to show you how to use the access level function. When you need different users to have access to different doors, this is how to set it up. We can make unlimited access levels with the software, but this time we only need to make two. The first access level will be just for the main entrance. The second access level will be for the main entrance and the storeroom. Let's go to doors. And you can see we have a main entrance I've already set up. The backlight is on and it's got a two second relay time. And in the picture you can see that backlight is on. Let's now create door two. So let's edit and let's call that store room. Let's adjust the settings. So let's have backlight on and let's have four seconds on that. And let's click on save. Let's take an init card. Click on init card to put the information into the card. That's done. Now let's present that to the storeroom reader. And let's exit. Now let's set up the access level. So we click on manage, access levels, and let's add a new access level. We need to give it a name. So let's just call this one main entrance. We need to select which reader is going to work on the access level called main entrance. So we need to uncheck them and let's just select that one and click on save. Now we need to add another access level and so it's going to be main and store. So let's make sure we select both the readers this time and click on save. So that's the access levels done. So let's exit that and we can add the users now. So let's add and let's say manager. This is where we select the access level. So the manager is going to do the main and store and we can click on save. Let's take a green fob and let's select issue card. The card's created. Let's put that to one side. We'll add the other user now. Let's call that user 2. And let's select the access level for user 2. Let's just say main entrance only. And save. Let's take another one. This time I have a blue fob. Click on issue card. And that's done. So now the manager can access both the main entrance and the storeroom. Well, the other user can do the main entrance, but when he goes to the storeroom, it doesn't work. It's as simple as that. Thank you for watching. Please click on like and subscribe. And don't forget to check out the other videos in the MyAccess series.